So how do we get ourselves a free safe VPN to use with Kali? Well hey guys it's WJ Pierce for Cybergrade and today we're going to be looking at exactly how we do that. So let's not waste any time and jump right into it. You want to navigate to Firefox and go to protonvpn.com forward slash support forward slash official Linux VPN Debian. You then want to scroll down to the hyperlink where it says download the Proton VPN Deb package and we don't want to open it, we just want to save the file. So you can see that we've saved it to downloads and it's got a name and the name might be slightly different depending on the release, they might be on 1.4 by the time you watch this. So we want to open up a terminal so we can actually install the repositories and the packages required for Proton. So we do sudo apt-get install then the path to where your package is. And as I said, we saved ours to downloads where you can see it is sitting. So we just go ahead and enter on that. Nice one, so that's us downloaded it. We now need to do a sudo apt update. So this is gonna update the local package lists. So we want to now do a sudo apt get install proton vpn hit y there we go and we should be good to go so we can start by typing proton vpn and it should spin up the gui now at this point you will need to have a proton account oh this is like the new um, keychain thing for macbook you should just create a password here there we go, so as I said, you will need a, an account already, so just sign up for a free account on the Proton website. Then you want to sign in. And there's a couple of things worth mentioning as I'm signing in here. Um, if you're using Tor, I don't really recommend using a VPN because it has a VPN built in and there's no point having two VPNs on the code, it's just gonna slow your traffic down. Do your research on VPNs. Um, I've found that Proton VPN is probably the best for my needs, um, but you might have different needs to me, you know, I'm just doing research and kind of messing about and maybe watching Netflix or something like that on the US, but you know, do your research. Um, also, don't assume that your VPN company is not handing data over to your local government because everyone has a price and almost every VPN company has a price also. Um, so yeah, uh, stay safe out there. So let's do a little test here. We can see that I just... Um, if you're watching there, did what is my location? It came up with Glasgow, which is where I am, Glasgow, Scotland. And we hit refresh on this after turning the VPN on, and it now thinks we are in Japan. So yeah, pretty cool. Um, we can come back to the terminal and press disconnect first on the GUI, and then we can come over here and press Control C, and that's us basically quitting out of Proton. So that's it. I hope that helped. It's a really quick, simple process. Um, if that helped, please subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.